I've got my Fanta, I've got my boarding pass. He has read it, and we're saying goodbye to London. We took uh I'm not sure what that sound is. We took an Uber to get here. Um the lady, Katarina, whom we are renting this Airbnb from, made arrangements with the coffee shop directly underneath of us. Yeah. Oh, the coffee shop. Yeah, we have the coffee shop. She might actually own the coffee shop. We'll see. Anyways. We just got here, we picked up the keys from the coffee shop and he kind of showed us around. And I'm just gonna shut up and show you guys where we're, it's beautiful. I love the fact that the toilet is separate from the shower. That means I can go do my business while he's doing other business. It's I like that. However, welcome to the kitchen. That window actually goes to the bathroom. That's, that's a little weird, right? That's a little weird upside. Anyways, let me show you the kitchen. So the lady that owns this place, Katarina, is supposed to meet us here at 8-ish, which is in about 30 minutes. Um, we noticed that there's a whole bedroom missing. So I went, I went back through the Airbnb listing and I was looking at all the pictures and everything looks right. And then I got to the floor plan and discovered that there is a hidden door that leads to an entirely separate bedroom and it has its own entrance. Here's the door. However, none of the keys we have operate that lock that's on that door. But there is a picture of it, second bedroom with separate entrance and then shows it on the floor plan spelling it out. So I don't know what the deal with it is. Hopefully she'll be able to help us with that when she gets here because there's two of us and one bed. Worst case scenario, that couch looks really comfortable. Katarina was super helpful. This woman knows what she's doing when it comes to Airbnbs. She left everything just so beautiful. I mean, this, I, this looks like a show apartment. Like if you wanted to rent an apartment, the leasing office would take you to an apartment like this. That's just perfectly put up. Or like an open house kind of thing. She left brochures and city tour guides and pocket books for the city. Oh, that one's not in English. Scratch that one. However, this map looks super useful. As much as I really want to hit the streets right now and just go look, I am absolutely exhausted. And that noise you just heard is my work. 
It is, they've been messaging me all day. And sadly, I don't actually start work for another two and a half hours. And then I have to work for eight. So for the next two weeks, my schedule, Prague time, is going to be 10 p.m. until 6 a.m. Yeah, you heard that right. It's awful. I'm ready to pass out and I, I still have another at least 10 hours to go. John looks like he has no fucks to give. John's realizing that the second room isn't opened up. It's going to be a very upsetting time. On the bright side, the women in Prague are beautiful. It's only a quarter till two in the afternoon in the US. So something interesting that's going on with my camera right now. The flickering, the rolling. It doesn't do it when I look at the light though. Only at the map that's reflecting the light from it. Katarina has came and ta-da! And there's a baby crib if you're interested. <laughs> this room's actually quite large. Although I'm quite confused because the floor plan does say that it has its own separate entrance. And unless you're climbing out the window, well, now I'm curious. Um, yeah, actually it looks like you can climb out the window and huh, we'll have to look at this in the daytime. All right, now my phone is charged. We've got everything situated here. I think it's now time to go get some groceries because that looks kind of sad. Other than that, of course. All right, so not perfect, but better. We got some beer, some butter, some sausage, some, I'm not sure what those are. That is apparently horse meat, uh, eggs, cheese, butter, we got stuff. We are bachelors after all. And now my work day begins. This guy, this guy is playing Rocket League. Yeah. And now this is happening. A very long, much needed bath. Yeah, that's, that's, that's happening. That was amazing. That was, oh. The only thing that can make that better, a nap. And by nap, I mean like 12 hours of sleep. It has been a rough weekend. I am so far behind on these videos. I am so sorry. I've got like six videos to edit and upload now, but it has been a crazy, super fast weekend. It's, we've, we've had a very small amount of sleep and crammed in a ton of activities, um, as you'll see or have already seen by the time you've seen this video, I guess. Yeah, so for now, nothing really exciting is gonna happen. I'm just gonna hop over there to my cute little desk here and work for the next six hours. <laughs>